Hello everyone, Hugo here with Abitronics in another two minute tech tip. Today, I'm going to give you seven ways that you can improve your home or your small business network security. Let's break this down. First, there's the cable modem. What does that do? It just connects you to your internet service provider, right? I know it can get confusing even though for us network and tech geeks, it's easy stuff. But for the most people, it can be a little confusing. So the cable modem connects you to your internet service provider. Then there's your router, different types of routers out there. But what does that do? It just passes and routes all of your devices to the internet. And finally, there's a firewall. And what's a firewall? It's just a security device. It's going to help protect your network. So let's dive into this. First and foremost, you got to change your router username because when they come in and they install everything, it is important that you switch out that username. The second thing you're going to do is change your password. Use a password generator. That's always helpful. Something that's different, something that you're not using your own family's name or something that everyone else may be able to access that network. So use a password generator. It always gives you some creative and complicated type of password. That's so important. So again, router username and your password. Then we're going to go to your network, the SSID, which is just simply your service set ID or the network name that pops up when I'm driving by your house or your small business and I say, hey, here's John's network, right? You're going to change that name to something unique. When you're done doing that, then we're going to create a guest network. Why? Well, if the com people are coming into your home, chances are they're not going to hack into your using your password into your network, right? But you always want to keep your personal network totally separate from anyone who comes over. Whether it's your business, even more important if it's a small business, you want to separate the network. So create that guest network. Another thing, turn off broadcasting your wireless network. You know, and what I mean is, you know, if you're at home, you pick up your neighbor's Wi-Fi, you can see there's John's network. You just want to just just turn it off. Don't broadcast it. And then you're going to turn on the firewall in the router. This is going to give you the, uh, that other layer of security for your network. And finally, this is something we all do not do, but it's so important. And I'm just reminding you, update your router's firmware. It's always so important to helping you know, secure that network environment within your home or small business. Again, there are many other things that you can do to really lock down the security of that network, but I'm giving you seven basic tips that you can do yourself, whether it's a home or a small business. We're here to help, my friends, so contact one of our consultants, our network specialist, more than happy to support you. Thank you again with the two-minute tech tip.